what it do you guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl the ariel xo today we're gonna do a little house tour for gta 5 rp okay for anybody in the server that's gonna tell me different yes this is my house um i live over here at 7709 my house drive okay period anyways uh this is basically the little driveway. I would have drove here, you know, gave out a little bit of tour, but I was already here, so. All right, when you pull up to the house, right here, it's automatically a little uh, basketball court. You already know, your girl is really good at basketball. I'm the best basketball player ever. Anthony Davis, who? Michael Jordan, who? Jordan, who? Oh, okay. But yeah, um, this is basically where, you know, the basketball court is. It's where it all go down, have a little basketball court party. I don't know, whatever it is that you please and want. Um, Right here is a little ping pong table if you're trying to play some ping pong. We got like a... I'm gonna be honest, like you could fit two cars in each side of the garage. I would say a two or three car garage, but you could fit two cars on each side. So like two right here, two right here, that's four. And then you have another car garage on this side. So that's like what, eight or something? I don't know. And then you have this little driveway so people could just pull up and it's all Gucci. We got a little grill out here, a little table, you know, have some lunch, some dinner, have a little cookout. I don't know, whatever you trying to do. On this side, this is where like the staircase is to go out to the beach. So if y'all trying to go do some morning yoga on the beach or something, boom, just go down the side and there is your staircase all right so when you first walk through the front door this is the entryway this is where you know you know when you walk in you put your keys down you take your shoes off take your coat off this is like the little clothes closet the shoe closet area i don't even know what you want to call it but formally this is where you would take your stuff off and then get situated in your house um i don't know what you want to call this right here like a little indoor river waterfront furnace i don't know i don't know what you want to call it but um we got that we got a little table right here with a random picture of this random man i feel like i know who he is but i don't know um to the right over here this is our little out or indoor pool not our outdoor pool indoor pool with a little bit of a shower right there you know it's supposed to get wet before you get in the water so it don't be super cold short little hot tub right here and then it goes outside to the outdoor pool and to the side over here this is like another little outdoor space basically you just saw it but Pull up your car or whatever. Over here is the little golf course. Very, very tiny. All you do, come over here, you swing some balls and you just swing them off into the water. I know that's probably like bad pollution, but we're gonna say we're gonna get somebody to go out there and pick it up or whatever. Over here is our outdoor pool, outdoor hot tub or whatever. Um, I really love this. Oops. I love this area. It's just so pretty to me. Like, the sun is shining. It's just, it's gorgeous. We should have a little pool party out here. Y'all wanna, would y'all come? Would y'all come to my little pool party if I had one? Anyways, this is the pool. It's so pretty. It has a little bridge walkway to go across. I've always loved pools like this because, um, I don't know, it just looks really cool. You can have like a water gun fight up here, like somebody down in the pool. Pretend it's a water gun, y'all. It's a water gun. You, you up here, right, and you got water in your gun, and then boom, 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 and then like, y'all just having a water gun fight, right? That'd be dope as hell. And then it's like a little outdoor seating area over here, another grill. You know, come out here, have a little barbecue pool party, have a, some time, relax with your boo, relax with your friends, all kinds of stuff. This is just so cute. Am I lying? Am I lying, though? I know I'm not lying, because I don't lie. Nah, let me stop lying. Going back inside in the entry area way, um, this is like a little chill area. You can sit, drink some coffee before work, drink some coffee before whenever i don't know whatever it is you trying to do they got some bongs too you could smoke a little bit what is it not smoke but is it smoking look i'm not a wee head so i don't know going down this way this is our little bar area our entertainment bar area so over here you would just sit down and drink your drinks with some guests or whoever read a book put some music on i don't know over here's a little dining room area so we got a dining room table it's fit for like hella people okay you can sit here and watch some tv while you eat or you can read a book or you can just eat and talk to people. Down this way, we have a McDonald's area right here. I know what y'all thinking, a McDonald's in your house? Girl, yes. I don't really eat McDonald's. I actually asked for like Chipotle or a Taco Bell because I don't actually eat out a lot. I don't actually eat fast food. So uh, when I do, the main places you gonna see me is like Chipotle or Taco Bell or something, but this is a McDonald's. This is all they said they could put in here. And I was like, you know what, I'll take it. I can get a little hash brown in the morning or you know, some pancakes or something. Uh, so yeah, then when you come out, we have a picture of my girl, Billie Eilish, or Billie Eyelash, as I love to call her. I don't know why, but I love eyelash. I, I don't know why, I just like it. But I don't mean it to be disrespectful, I love her, and I love her music, she's really cool. Over here is the kitchen. Um, somebody had some pizza earlier, 
there and they they ain't pick it they ain't put it up in the refrigerator or nothing and they, they ain't wash the dishes either oh yeah we're gonna be fighting but this is the kitchen this is where everybody be cooking at um i don't live here alone i do i am in a gang so some of my gang does live here uh here's the winery and then over here is just another little sink area clean some dishes or have somebody come and cook for you and clean dishes back there another kind of little dining area right here over here is the living area this is basically where we chill at we sit on the couch with our boot things we sit here on the couch with our friends or whoever and we watch some cartoons and we laugh and we make jokes and we rap and we listen to music and all kinds of stuff over here through the kitchen is a little outdoor patio this on honestly just leads back around to over here um to the back yard area you know um, down here, this is basically where you can get some tanning going on. I don't need to tan because I'm black. You know what I mean? I'm a black girl. What am I tanning for? I'm already naturally melanated. But it's also another outdoor grill, chill, eat area, I guess you want to call it. And then also on this side is just another way to get down to the beach, which is pretty cool, really chill, which I love. Because, you know, if you have a fire, you can just easily escape to the beach. Um, Back to the living room area. We got a piano over here. We got my man's The Weeknd or Abel. That's my ex-husband because we broke up for whatever reason. And yeah, this leads right back out to the backyard or the pool area, which I love so much as I already mentioned. And yeah, that's basically the downstairs area. So heading up the stairs, the staircase has lights on it, which I think is super, super cool. I love it. Right over here is a little chill, chill area. You know, I'm sorry I didn't clean up or nothing, but it's just going to be a looking a little crusty out here but this is the chill area you can sit right here watch some tv with some people eat some pizza or something um this is our in-home studio so we do have a couple of rappers in town you know what i mean it's a couple of people out here who got some skills they're not better than me though y'all know i'm i'm the best at rapping i'm the best so we got a couple people here who have signed some deals and you know cut some records here i don't know if i showed y'all before but i can show y'all here if y'all need to see Y'all nigga ballin', I'm feelin' like Jordan, they should call a nigga the motherfuckin' goat. The money keep callin', I'm chasing these hundreds, a nigga need bread, yeah, a nigga need dope. Inside the studio, this is just all the equipment, the drums, the setup, the recording equipment, and everything like that. Produce some really cool music. Inside the studio is a bathroom, full bathroom, well not a full bathroom, half bathroom, no shower or tub, anything, just a toilet. When you walk around... Um, that door just leads to that bathroom, but going down the hallway, it is our meeting room. This is where we meet up for our gang. This is where we talk about gang stuff. Um, and this is also where we cut some, you know, records or whatever. Don't mind the money. We just ain't put it up or nothing, but, um, <laughs> this is where we cut some record deals, where we have our meetings about a lot of different stuff, not even just gang and, um, music related. Also... Y'all already know how I feel about my dude, Drake. That is my husband to the top. So we got a little portrait up there, OVO. He came through, he came through and put a little, you know, he signed it or whatever and it was really cool. So shout out to him. Right here is the pool table. It is kind of placed randomly. I feel like this pool table shouldn't be right here, but um, it's cool. It just leads back out here to the balcony at the top of the house. We have another chill area. You can come out here and eat some breakfast, some lunch, some dinner, I don't know. A guitar area with a telescope you know come out here look at the stars at nighttime i don't know whatever it is that you want to do on the side of the house it is another chill living space so you can come out here with your people drink some champagne or whatever and watch some tv or you can listen to some music out here whatever it is that you want to do going around this side of the balcony it's a little day bed out here for you to just chill on and watch the stars or whatever it is pretty dark because it's nighttime but um this is basically what's going on outside going back into the house down this hallway we have like a little gym area right here because y'all know we've been in the house quarantine for like a year so we got some treadmills for people to you know get their exercise on um, we got some weights, some boxing bags or whatever. So <laughs> if you need to, you know, practice your boxing or whatever, there you go. There go a boxing bag, a punch bag. And it also leads out to the balcony right here. I don't think this door opens, but got a couple people out here who come out here and do some personal training if that's what you need. But yeah, we're going to get you right for the summer 2021. I know this pandemic is still happening, but honestly, it's never going to be over because we live in a world where America runs everything and everything revolves around america all right so in this room this is the first bedroom this is not my bedroom but this is one of the bedrooms for somebody in the house um they have a little closet over here a nice flat screen tv right here i don't know how many inches that is 
a bed and then also this little modern sitting chair i don't even know what you want to call this but i think this is actually really nice and that's really cute a full bathroom which i am in love with i love the bathrooms in this house because they just they're so pretty they have marble and they're very modern yeah so you got a shower a toilet and a sink and even extra closet space and then this also just leads out to the balcony at the front of the house so you can see who's coming in so who trying to come up in your house come up here and you know steal stuff or whatever the case may be all right walking back out to the second bedroom over here it's literally the same thing um maybe a couple of things are different the closet is over here and the bed is right here uh still the flat screen tv we have this lamp and then they have two chairs right here instead of like a big nice modern chair um still a full bathroom with a little indoor closet or whatever you want to call it I think these bathrooms are just so nice and like I said they also have access to go outside on the balcony to see who coming up in the crib who pulling up in the driveway going back out into the hallway there's like a little seating area right here if you need to sit down in the hallway I don't know um some posters on the walls I don't even know who these people are but you know some posters uh here's another bedroom that it, it looks just like the other bedrooms um flat screen tv bed and closet and then full bathroom just on the opposite side now here is my bedroom y'all you know i got the biggest bedroom in the house y'all should know y'all already know so my bedroom consists of this gigantic bed it's not really gigantic but this really nice large bed flat screen tv sorry i was watching what is this dory or nemo a little desk area over there and then over here is like a little chill couch area counting up some money drinking some wine you know and um here's that little desk area and then we have a walk-in closet so it's a little bit different from all the other rooms other rooms closets are just like against the wall but this is a walk-in closet um, I do share this room with somebody. I don't know who, but I share it with somebody. Also in this room, it has full access to the balcony once again. Almost every room does, but you just walk outside. And this one actually has like an ocean view. You can't see it right now that much because it's nighttime. But this is basically, you know, that's basically the view. Maybe I'll come here in the daytime so y'all can see. <music> All right, over here is the full, full bathroom. So this bathroom has everything that you need, but it's all separated kind of. So over here, this is where the sinks are. Brush your teeth, wash your face, whatever it is you need to do. This could be like a little massage table. Have somebody come out here and massage your back, your stomach, your body, whatever you need to do. Here is a tub right here. Take a little dip, you know what I mean? You can watch some TV while you're in the shower or not in the shower, while you're in the bath and just relax. And then over here, the actual toilet is separated from the main bathroom, but you can watch some TV while you're on the toilet. Wash your hands in here. And it also leads right outside to the balcony, right back here. This is basically how this is. And then you can also see like who's coming in the front gate from here, which I think is pretty cool walk around the side and it leads you back to all of the bedrooms over here as you can tell i don't know if you can tell but uh yeah that's basically all that it is for this house right here this bedroom area i love my bedroom it's the best bedroom out of all of them um you know the decor is not really my style but get what you get and you don't you don't throw no fits right okay period that's basically all that i have to show y'all so yeah you guys that's basically a house tour of my little house out here in trapping rp if i didn't know if y'all wanted to know which specific um server this is this is trapping rp it's not a serious rp server so don't come in here expecting it to be serious i just make it serious a lot of the time um that's just because that's what i do and i can do that um because i'm me um <laughs> but it's not a serious rp service it's a 100k or die server i'm not really a big fan of those but i've grown accustomed to this server because i've met some pretty cool people and we've had a lot of fun so yeah if you're wanting to experience the server and have a little bit of fun you know get your shooting game up or whatever just come through it'll be fun um sometimes we do have serious moments for rp like we have weddings um funerals beach parties studio parties whatever it is that y'all are wanting we can make that happen because y'all know who i am and i got the power now just playing i don't got no power but i'm just saying um we can try to make it happen but if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up give it a like comment down below i don't even know and i will see y'all in the next video bye